हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल क्रोशे विजारा टुडे वी आर क्रोशेइंग अ स्टनिंग लेस क्रॉप टॉप विद लॉन्ग स्लीव्स परफेक्ट फॉर स्प्रिंग एंड समर दिस स्मॉल साइज डिज़ाइन इज आइडियल फॉर एडिंग अ टच ऑफ एलिगेंस टू योर वार्ड्रॉप एंड कैन बी वॉर्न एज अ फैशनेबल टॉप लेयर्ड अंडर कार्डिगन्स और गिव वन एज अ थॉटफुल गिफ्ट सो ग्रैब योर योन एंड हुक एंड लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड इन द फन टूटोरियल फॉर दिस प्रोजेक्ट आई एम यूजिंग अ थ्री प्लाई ऑन इज अ बॉल ऑफ हंड्रेड ग्राम्स and a 3 mm hook i'm going to make a small size just make a slip knot and work total of 175 chains if you want to make it a medium size you can add 28 chains in this 175 total of 203 and if you want to make a larger size then you can add more 28 chains to 170 203 chains now work total of 175 chains 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 now i have work total of 175 chains now just take the other end of the chain and make sure that it is not twisted and slip stitch into the first chain to make a big circle now for the round 1 work chain 4 1 2 3 and 4 this chain 3 i will count it as a double crochet and chain 1 as a chain 1 space now yarn over skip next stitch and work a double crochet into the chain right after the skip stitch yarn over pull through 2 yarn over pull through 2 now chain 1 skip stitch and work a double crochet into the next chain 1 skip stitch and work a double crochet into the next stitch chain 1 skip stitch and work a double crochet into the next stitch chain 1 skip stitch work a double crochet into the next stitch chain 1 skip stitch work a double crochet into the next stitch chain 1 skip stitch work a double crochet into the next stitch in this way work a double crochet and chain 1 skip stitch work a double crochet and i will meet you at this point now you can see i have one chain left so i am going to work chain 1 and 1 2 into the third chain work a slip stitch now i am going to start my round 2 now chain 2 1 and 2 and work a half double crochet into the chain 1 space you on over and pull through all the three loops now work a half double crochet on the top of double crochet now work a half double crochet into the chain one space now work a half double crochet on the top of double crochet work a half double crochet into the chain one space in the same way work double half double crochet into chain one space and half double crochet on the top of double crochet half double crochet into chain one space half double crochet on the top of double crochet half double crochet into chain one space half double crochet on the top of double crochet half double crochet into the chain one space half double crochet on the top of double crochet half double crochet into the chain one space half double crochet into the on the top of double crochet keep going by working half double crochet into the chain one space and on the top of double crochet and i will meet you at this point now i have worked double half double crochet in chain one space and on the top of double crochet 
now slip stitch into the chain 2 now this is going to be our third round and we are going to work chain 4 2 3 and 4 chain 3 as a double crochet and chain 1 as a chain 1 space yarn over and work our double crochet into the same where we slip stitch now chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and skip next 6 stitches 1 1 2 3 4 5 6 and into the 7th stitch this one 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and into the 7th this one work at B stitch or double crochet chain 1 and double crochet into the same chain stitch chain 1 and double crochet into the same now chain 7 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5, 6, 7 skip next 6 stitches 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and into the seventh work a V stitch double crochet chain one and double crochet into the same stitch now again work chain seven one two three four five six seven yarn over skip six stitches one two three four five six and into the seventh one work a V stitch chain 1 and in the same way work V stitches after every 6 stitches with a chain 7 in between ok I will meet you at this point now that I have reached the end now 1 2 3 4 5 6 slip stitch into the chain 3 1 2 and 3 Now again slip stitch into the V stitch. Now our round 3 is completed. Now for the round 4 work chain 4, 2, 3, 4 and double crochet into the same space. Now repeat this round 4 as round 3. Work chain 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and work a V stitch into the V stitch double crochet chain 1 and double crochet into the same space now again work chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 work a V stitch into the V stitch chain 1 and double crochet into the same space now work chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 yarn over and V stitch into the V stitch chain 1 and now repeat the stitch pattern and I will meet you at this point now I have reached the end of row 4 now slip stitch into the chain 3 1 2 3 now slip stitch into the V stitch and again work chain 4 1 2 3 4 this is my row number 5 1 2 3 4 and this is 5 now work a double crochet into the same space now in this row we are going to work chain 3 1 2 3 slip stitch into the chain 7 space again work chain 3 1 2 3 and work a V stitch into the V stitch chain 1 and double crochet into the now again chain 3 1 2 3 slip stitch into the chain 7 space chain 3 1 2 3 and work a V stitch into the V stitch chain 1 and
now again chain 3 1 2 3 slip stitch into the chain 7 space and chain 3 1 2 3 and we stitch into the v stitch keep going by working this stitch pattern and i will meet you at the end of round 5 now i have reached the end of row number 5 slip stitch into the chain 3 slip stitch into the v stitch now i am going to start my row number 6 in row number 6 work chain 3 and double crochet into the same space chain 1 and 2 double crochet into the same space now chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and work into the v stitch 2 double crochet chain 1 and 2 double crochet 2 double crochets chain 1 and 2 double crochets now again work chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and work 2 double crochet chain 1 and 2 double crochet into the same space chain 1 and again work chain 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 yarn over work 2 double crochet into the v stitch chain 1 and 2 double crochet into the same space repeat this stitch pattern until you reach the end of the round okay i will meet you at this point now i have reached the end of the row 6 now slip stitch into the chain 3 now for the row 7 we have to work in this space so slip stitch and slip stitch again into the now work chain 3 and double crochet chain 1 and 2 double crochet into the same space now chain 3 1 2 3 slip stitch into the chain 7 again chain 3 1 2 3 and slip stitch oh sorry two double crochets chain 1 and two double crochet into the same space again chain 3 1 2 3 slip stitch into the chain 7 space 1 2 3 2 double crochet chain 1 and 2 double crochet into the same space chain 1 and now repeat this stitch pattern until you reach the end of the round 7 so we are going to repeat these two rows round 6 and round 7 until you get row number 13 okay i will meet you at the row number 13 just, just repeat the row number 6 and 7 until you get the row number 13 okay i will meet you at the end of round 13 now that i have completed my 13 rows if we count from here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and 13 now we are going to start over row 14 now slip stitch into the next stitch slip stitch into the next stitch slip stitch slip stitch into the next stitch and slip stitch into the chain one space now chain three one two three and work double crochet chain one and double crochet into the same now chain seven one two three four five six seven and repeat the same stitch pattern row seven sorry chain seven repeat the same stitch pattern and 
वर्ड टोटल ऑफ वन वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट एंड आई विल मेट यू एट एट दिस पॉइंट आई हैव वर्क टोटल ऑफ एट वर्टिकल वी स्टिच इज रोज एज यू इफ वी काउंट ही फ्रॉम यूर वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एंड एट नाउ फ्रॉम दिस पॉइंट वी आर गोइंग टू वर्क ओवर स्लीव सेक्शन सो वी आर गोइंग टू वर्क चेन ट्वेंटी थ्री इफ यू आर मेकिंग अ मीडियम साइज यू कैन स्किप नाइन वी स्टिच इज रोज बट आई एम मेकिंग स्मॉलर साइज सो आई एम गोइंग टू वर्क एट एट वी स्टिच इज रोज एंड चेन ट्वेंटी थ्री वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन अलेवन ट्वेल्व थर्टीन फोर्टीन फिफ्टीन सिक्सटीन सेवनटीन एटीन नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी टू एंड ट्वेंटी थ्री now this is my sleeve so i am going to skip four v stitches vertical rows 1 2 3 4 so in the fifth one i am going to attach by working double crochet if you are making a medium size you can skip five vertical rows of v stitches now chain 2 oh sorry double two double crochets chain 1 and Two double crochets into the same space. Now, for the back part, we are going to work same. We are going to work in nine V stitches rows. Just repeat the same stitch pattern: chain seven, two double crochets, chain one, two double crochets, chain seven, two double crochets, chain one, two double crochets, and I will meet you at the. Um, we have to work in the back part nine vertical rows: one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, and nine. We have just to make sure we have left total of four vertical lace rows for the arm. So, if you are making a medium size, you can stop at tenth vertical row. Now, again, work chain twenty three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. Now you have total of four vertical lace rows left. One, two, three, four, and into the fifth one we are going to slip stitch into the chain three. Now we are done with over row. Fourteen. Now for the row fifteen, just slip stitch into the next stitch and slip stitch into the next. Now repeat the stitch pattern of chain three, slip stitch and chain three, chain three, double crochet, chain one and double crochet into the. Now chain three, one, two, three. Slip stitch into the chain seven space. Chain three and slip stitch. Uh, double crochet. Chain one. Double crochet. Chain one and two double crochets. And I will meet you at this point where over chain twenty three started. Now I have reached at the point where the chain. Twenty-three started. Now chain three, one, two, three, and skip the next one, two, three chain. One, two, three into the fourth one. Work a slip stitch. Again chain three, one, two, three, and skip one, two, three into the fourth one. Work double crochet. Again double crochet. Chain one and two double crochets into the same. Now again, chain three, one, two, three. Skip one, two, three, and into the fourth one. Work a slip stitch. Now one, two, three. 
now 1 2 3 1 2 3 into the fourth one work a Now again chain 3, 1, 2, 3, skip 1, 2, 3 into the fourth one, work a slip stitch. Again 1, 2, 3 and skip these three chains and into the chain 1 space. 2 double crochets, chain 1 and 2 double crochets into the same. Now repeat the same pattern on the other side of the sleeves so we have a sleeves hole arm hole repeat the same pattern until you reach the end of the row 15 now after this row we have to repeat the same repeat rows number 5 and 6 sorry 6 and 7 repeat row number 6 and 7 until you reach the more 15 rows total of if we count from here total of 30 rows this is the same exact thing and i will meet you at the end of the 30th row so we have a armhole and just do the same as i did here and i will meet you at the row number 30 now i have just separated the sleeves part and the body part remember that in the front part i just repeat the pattern in the uh, eight vertical lace rows and for the back part i have worked in nine lace vertical rows and i just uh, skip four lace vertical rows for the sleeves part from now on we have to work 15 more repeat rows number 6 and 7 so i will meet you after working total of 15 rows repeat row number 6 and 7 okay i will meet you then i have completed a total of 34 rows as 30 rows did not meet the desired length of 13 inches to achieve the desired length i added four more rows bringing the total to 34 this length provides the coverage i need but feel free to add more rows if you prefer a longer top that covers your stomach the choice is yours but for my project 13 inches is the perfect fit now i am going to start my 35th row now slip stitch into the next stitch slip stitch into the chain one space now chain four chain three as double crochet and chain one as chain one space yarn over and work a double crochet back into the same chain one space now chain two one and two skip over to three chains and into the fourth chain one two three work a double crochet chain one and double crochet into the same space remember that i have ended up at repeat row number six chain seven space row so you also have to end up at repeat row number six now chain 2 1 and 2 and skip over to chain 1 space and work double crochet chain 1 and double crochet into the same chain 1 space now chain 2 1 and 2 and skip over to chain 3 and into the fourth one work a double crochet chain 1 and double crochet back into the same chain chain 2 and skip over to chain 1 space and work double crochet chain one and double crochet into the same space so so repeat this stitch pattern i'll meet you at this point now i have reached the end and work chain two and slip stitch into the chain three space and slip stitch into the chain one space now chain three one two three and this is my row number 36 yawn over and work two double crochets into the same chain one space one and two now i am going to work a peacock stitch chain three one two three and slip stitch into the beginning of the double crochet stitch yarn over pull pull up the loop and pull through this is a peacock stitch now yarn over and work three double crochet back into the same chain one space one two and three now you can see 
this is a peacock stitch now chain one and skip over to chain one space and work a slip stitch into the chain one space chain one work three double crochets into the chain one space after skipping this now chain one and skip over to chain one space and work three double crochets back into the same chain one space two and three chain three or peacock stitch and slip stitch at the beginning of the double crochet stitch and work three double crochets back into the same chain one space one two and three chain one skip over to chain one space and work a slip stitch chain one and skip over to chain one space and work three double crochets one two and three chain three one two three and work a slip stitch at the beginning of double crochet now work three double crochets back into the same chain one space two and three now you can see now repeat the same stitch pattern and i will meet you at this point now i have reached the end chain one slip stitch into the chain one space chain one and slip stitch into the chain three to end the round Now chain one and slip of the yarn. Now I have just completed my body part. Now I am going to work with my sleeves. Now just take this end or take this point of the sleeve section and just join the yarn into the chain one space now insert the hook into the chain one space and work a slip stitch now chain three one two three yarn over work a double crochet chain one and two double crochet back into the same chain one space now as we have ended up at uh, row seven so we are going to work repeat row number six chain sevens two three four five six seven yawn over skip over to entire this space and work double crochet Two double crochets chain one and two double crochets back into the same chain one space now again work chain seven one two three four five six seven skip over to chain one space and work two double crochets chain one and two double crochets back into the chain one space chain one and now repeat the stitch pattern and i will meet you at the at this point right before over chain 23 started now i have reached at the point and you can see we are reached at the point where we just may work where we just worked chain 23 now you can put your finger here and you came along with the finger and you see the point chain one space you have to work in that chain one space yawn over two double crochets chain one and two double crochets back into the same chain one space now chain seven 
थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एंड स्किप ओवर टू दिस स्पेस चेन वन स्पेस एंड वर्क टू डबल क्रोशेस चेन वन एंड टू डबल क्रोशेस नौ चेन सेवन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एंड कॉन्टिन्यू द स्टिच पैटर्न एंड स्लिप स्टिच हेयर एंड फ्रॉम द नेक्स्ट रो वी हैव टू वर्क विद ओवर रेगुलर स्टिच पैटर्न रिपीट रो नंबर दिस इज सिक्स एंड वी विल वर्क रिपीट रो नंबर सेवन इन विच वेयर वी वर्क डबल क्रोशेस चेन वन डबल क्रोशेस चेन थ्री स्लिप स्टिच इन टू द चेन सेवन स्पेस अगेन चेन थ्री एंड इन टू द दिस चेन वन स्पेस डबल क्रोशेस Two double crochets, chain one and two double crochets back into the same space, and I will meet you at the point where we have to work the ending. Okay, I will meet you then. Now I have worked total of forty-five rows for the sleeves. Now, now this is my forty-fifth row. Now slip stitch into the next stitch and slip stitch into the chain one space. Now work. Chain four, one, two, three, four, and work a double crochet. Same as we did in the body part. And this is going to be our ending rows. This is my second last row. Now chain two, and skip three chains and into the fourth chain. One, two, three into the fourth one. Work a double crochet. Chain one and double crochet into the same chain. Chain two, and work a double crochet. Chain one and double crochet. In the same way, work chain two, one and two. Skip three chains, one, two, three, and to the fourth one. Work a V stitch, chain one and double crochet into the same. Now chain two, and V stitch into this chain one space. Okay, I will meet you at the end of this round. Keep going by working the stitch pattern, and I will meet you at this point. Now I have reached the end. Now chain three, slip stitch into the chain three, one, two, and three. And slip stitch into the chain one space. Now this is my last row. I am going to work chain three. Work a double crochet. And two more double, one more double crochet. Total of two double crochet and chain three. Now chain three, one, two, three, and work a peacock stitch into this loop or top of the double crochet. Work a slip stitch and three more double crochet into the same space. One, two, three. Now chain one. Work a slip stitch into this chain one space. Again chain one and work three double crochet. Same as we did in the body part. Chain three, one, two, three, and slip stitch into the top of double crochet to work a peacock stitch and work three double crochet into the same space. One, two, and three. Now chain one, work a slip stitch into the. Chain one space, chain one, and again work three double crochet, chain three, slip stitch into the top of double crochet, peacock stitch, and again three double crochets, and the stitch will look like this. Okay, I will complete my row, and in the end, I am I am going to work a slip stitch, and I will show you the final results. Your gorgeous lace crop top with long sleeves is now complete, and you have a unique handmade piece to add to your wardrobe. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial as much as I did. If you like to share your finished project, please leave a comment below or tag me on social media at the Red Crochet Wizara. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more crochet tutorials and pattern, and hit the notification bell to stay updated. Thanks for watching and happy hooking. See you in the next tutorial. Until then, take great care of yourself. Bye bye.